What's up gamers, gamers and gamers, my name is John and welcome back to Who is Mike? I kind of sound like a freaking uh, one of those people on television that's like game show hosts like yeah who is he is he real is he fake or whatever <laughs> anyways guys last time we uncovered the fake mic and we're about to go kick his ass we have a badass girlfriend freaking ready to shoot this fucker and I have a bat and let's see how this is gonna go that's pretty much how what I remember it's been a while since I played this so let's try to finish it today and if not then whatever let's do this it didn't look like it was going to stop him for long. Oh God. Run Sarah! Run girl! Nah, no, don't run, fucking shoot him. Back off! Oh! Oh, what? <laughs> Did he shot him? What? You brought your gun with you? Fucking smart wife. If she's a cop, what'd you expect? I heard he thunk. Better safe than sorry. You mean... Better paranoid than d Oh shit! A monster is force flung my body and I collided with the hard wall of my living room. Oh shit! I felt my ribs br break with the impact. Oh my god, I better not die. Fucking, I made my freaking smart choice. Sarah, what the fuck? Mike! Sarah, Sarah, shoot the fucker, bastard! Wait, I forgot how it works. Hold on, bastard! Oh shit! Sarah fired more shots at the creature. One of them grazed him on the left arm. It wasn't enough to maim him. The fake might have swept the gun out of Sarah's hand, and he careened under the table. What the fuck? Gah. Oh my God. He grabbed Sarah by the neck. Oh, hell no. Uh, it's time. No, I know I have a broken rib. Sarah, but I'm going to come and save you. Oh, shit. Fear bubbled up inside me. Oh, shit. No, not our wife, man. Not our fucking wife, man. Like, shit, wait. Fear bubbled up inside me. It was bigger than any pain I've since I endured, I, since I've since I've endured, I don't know. Sarah, N no, let her go. Oh shit, she he better not die. He better not kill Sarah. I swear to God. Sarah groaned helplessly, struggling against the inhuman hand that belonged to me. Cold sweat en enveloped my skin, and in a thin, terrified film. Easy now, boy. I'm not going to kill her. Dots. Yet. Oh, hell no! I heard a snicker escape from the attacker's mouth. Oh, shit! That's that's fu that scared the shit out of me. But look at this fucking mess. You really should have just stayed unconscious when I hit you with that bat, you know? Spared us all this drama. G go to hell! Yeah, you bastard. Oh, we will, I prom- Oh, oh shit, oh what the fuck. After all, the host has to be alive while I eat- Oh, hell no. I go- When you say uh, eat, do you mean- no, not your flesh, boy. Life. Life is so much tastier than flesh. Your memories, your thoughts, your future. All the things you that make you human. Mm, I help myself. Don't mind if I do. And when you've stripped down and barren to the bone, you will simply wither away. Like a scab that once flesh and blood one week to live I I'll think about that later I'm gonna fucking think about that oh hell no you bitch you better not fucking I'll kill that motherfucker um right now I have to I have to get to Sarah to safety my eyes darted to her my insights cherry 
at her labored breathing. The imposter followed my eyes went with a knowing chuckle. So, shall we start with your lovely Sarah? Oh, hell no, bitch. You better not do it. Worked our way down. Piece by piece. Oh, hell no. Where's the gun? I'm gonna fucking grab the gun. I'm gonna shoot this motherfucker. I can't take it. Fucking, oh my god. I'm going gonna go joysy on him, man. I ain't gonna go with that shit. Sarah, Sarah struggled as I grip on her throat tightened. The creature started to lift her up from the floor by her neck. St stop! Stop, please! I beg of you! Please, I'll, I'll do anything. Anything. The bat fell from my hands as I surrender. Shit. All hope is lost. My knees buckled and I crashed to the floor. Anything? Would you cut? What, what could you possibly give me that I can't take, human? Dots. You did get to find out by, uh, uh found out by a local police officer. Looks, looks to me that you need help crafting a more human image. <laughs> Dots. I'm a writer. I, I do it for a living. Well, uh, but not really say I'm a writer. I, mean, my, I could see that, but yeah. whatever. I'm not gonna get to me. Let's focus on Mikey. Fake Mike's ears picker pricked up. A grin spread across his face. You just let it go, please. I don't know how, but I'll make it worth your while. I was still contemplating my fate when Fake Mike let out a sudden yelp of pain. Oh shit! It seems that ah, <laughs> he kicked up. She kicked him in the nuts. Yes. Oh my god! It seems that Sarah kicked him in the nuts. As he gripped loosened around her, her, <laughs> her neck, Sarah broke Fake Mite's finger down with his knuckle. Oh shit! There we go, Sarah. You're a badass. Oh my god! He screamed in fury. Sarah dropped to the ground and grasped him for air. <laughs> You always did talk too much. You pump its ass. <laughs> I just like how she's like, she's on the ground, she's got some ass, and you're fucking like, you fucking pump its ass, you dumbass. Stop talking too much. But you fucking made time. <clears throat> Big Mike let out a growl as he lunged for Sarah. So, oh, hell no, don't you dare do that. But Sarah managed to slip away from him. Oh, there we go, Sarah. That's how it's done. Sarah, get out of the house. Get out while you still while you can. Idiot. Back. Oh god, wait. What am I doing? Like I'm gonna leave you to be eaten. Shit. That's a faithful girl. That's a faithful girl. Fucking don't let your man die, and don't let your girl die. She sprinted upstairs to find another weapon. Wait, then where's the gun that you freaking? I don't know. You st stubborn. You'll get cornered upstairs. Uh, oh shit. Angry black dots began to dance in my vision. Oh shit. I know I, I know how that feels, especially when I see stars when I get light lightheaded or fucking I don't know whenever I work. Uh, anyways. The pain in my side poke poked my consciousness, prudent prudent my vision to wither. I I can't lose conscious now. I Oh shit, that scared the shit out of my ears, man at me. I was jolted awake, jolted, awakened by the sound of a huge crash. Sir, ow! How long was I unconscious for? Oh, so what did that even take that long? The stand clock informed me if I've been lying here for t around 10 minutes or so. Really? Fucking, I don't know. I sighed in relief. <sighs> Looks like I haven't been long out. Well, it's not that long. I tried to stand up. Oh my god, my ribs! My ribs! <laughs> I called it up. Well, yeah. But I have to get up. I have to get Sarah. Make sure she's safe, man. I crawled towards Sarah's gun under the- There we go! Yeah, that's a smart guy. Apart from the crash that I woke up, everything 
was dead quiet in how oh, okay I don't like that I didn't know what I hated more the silence or the anticipation of Sarah's screams is anybody even here now I whipped up white blood uh, dripping off my chin and steadied myself I have to be sure did you at least grab the gun and then freaking got up and then try to look around? Ugh. My sides felt like they were on fire. Every step I took sent a jolt pain through my whole body. Oh, yes, those stairs are going to be a fun ride. Oh, boy. Oh, cool. That's cool. You got the little cute little flower and there's like the lights in our room and that cute book why am i even looking at this i made it um i made my way to the second floor with little ease this place didn't feel feel like my home anymore oh okay like i enter another dimension that looked the same but was not the least bit similar tiny beads of sweat popped across my forehead i don't even know why i just read that very slowly i don't I held the, the gun close. Oh, there you go. He brought the gun with him. Don't panic. <laughs> I have to focus on protecting Sarah. Yes, good man. I don't care about what happens to me. Oh, that's it. That's good. I just want her safe. Sarah, if you're there, please call out to me. Let me know you're here. I hope she's not fucking dead or unconscious. Like, shit. I waited a couple seconds before my ears prickled up. My muffled said, Oh, shit. Mike! It came from the guest room. Oh, they have a guest room? That's cool. I hurried up. Mm. I hurried over to the door and tried to open it. Sarah? Oh, Mike! <coughs> I'm glad you found me. I found... There was something weird about the way she was like, Oh, don't tell me that fucking transform into fucking Sarah. That was suck so much. But I couldn't quite make it out. Get me out of here, Mike. I jiggled the log, uh, but it didn't open. Uh, I'm scratched up good. We have to get out of here before that monster comes back. I winced again. Is this really Sarah? I don't know. I'm having my skeptical, like, skepticism, skeptical. Her voice sounded really strange, but I shrugged it off and continued to push the door open. Give me a second. Just shoot the fucking log. I tried again, but the door wouldn't budge. Sarah, I think the door might be stuck. Damn it. Don't worry, I'll get you out, I promise. I tried kicking the door. Uh, I guess I can work too. One more kick. The pain sh shot my leg like a ball of electric fire. But now was not the time to be stopped. To be a sop. A sop? That was a sop. I don't know. I, kick I kicked it a couple more each time. Each time it, it was glowing red pain in my extremities. Extremities. Blah, 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 blah. There you go. There you go. There you go. Pretty soon the door showing signs of movement. Mike, what are you doing? It was Sarah, but the voice didn't come from the door. Oh, shit. I fucking called it. I fucking called it. And the music getting more scarier. I turned around. <gasps> oh, no. No, my beautiful. No, my girl. She's all bloody. Oh, hell no. This fucker's gonna die now. In front of me was another Sarah. Bloody and injured. Her arm limp at the right shoulder. Wait. Wait. Oh, shit. Wait, that's right. Sarah sh fucking shot him. A couple times, but who knows. I mean, he shot him in the fucking arm. And I don't know about the other part. Shit. Ah, oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. Fuck. Ah, oh, shit. It's gonna make me do choices, isn't it? In front of in front of me was another Sarah, bloody and injured. Her her arm limped at the right shoulder. I stared at her listlessly. S Sarah? 
Don't open that damn door, Mike. That bastard is in there. Mike, what's happening? Sarah? There's Sarah. There's Sarah here too? Shit, Mike, listen to me. She is not real. Fuck. Alright. This is this is gonna be tough a little bit, but I she even even say you shot him in the arm. That's why I'm not sure about trusting this bitch. I don't know if this is the real Sarah. She's not real. Fuck that. That's that's the fake one inside. I was able to fight it off and lock it in lock it inside the room. It kept ramming the door over and over until the door got stuck. Oh shit. Maybe that shit. Oh, maybe she is telling the truth. That's a lie, Mike. I ran ran to the room and locked it from the inside. It destroyed the door so I can't get it out. Bullshit. Get me out. Wait, fuck. Which one is talking? I mean, it should. There's two Sarah's. That's right. Get me out of here. Please, don't listen to her. Mike, look at me. I'm the real Sarah. Shit. <laughs> my mind couldn't believe what was happening. Edges of the mind grain pressed my fridges of my brain. My hands tightened on the gun. If you open that door, Mike, I'm quite, quite sure that bastard is going to come straight for me. It doesn't need my essence. It needs yours. He'll kill me for sure. Mike, listen to me. It is trying to trick you. You have to believe me, Mike. Mike, please. The servant in front of me took a step forward. I pulled the gun near my chest, but I couldn't bring myself to aim it at her. She stopped. Get back, Sarah. L let me think. Shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Shit. Ow. Just get back, Dots. My heart ran in my chest. I knew I had to be I had to calm down. At this point I wouldn't be able to think clearly. Oh, who am I kidding? Even on a good day, I couldn't do the, the truth like Sarah. Oh. Even on good that I couldn't use the truth like Sarah. I'm not a detective. Mike, please, you have to shoot the fake one. Shoot the fucking bastard. I don't know why I just gave her that accent. All right. Just what? What? Just what the bitch wants, isn't it? Don't listen to that monster. If we just leave it there, we can escape. It just dis it's just desperate to get out, Mike. Mike, please believe me. Put the gun down. Mike, I know it's hard, but you have to be brave. I need to think first. This is too sudden. But what am I going to do? The weight of the situation made my hands shake. Can I really murder someone in cold blood? Somebody I love? Dots. If I make a decision too hastily, it's a mistake I can never undo. Don't- What? Hold on! Hold on! Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Don't you. I just- It fucking made me rush. I just couldn't do it. I can't shoot her. I can't even aim at her. I looked into her bleeding, eye, bleeding eyes and felt overwhelming surge of love and helplessness. She has to be my Sarah. She has to be. I stood up with an effort and limped towards her. M Mike! Behind me, the other Sarah's voice screamed. It's gonna be alright, honey. She held her, her uninjured hand out to me and I reached it blindly. Oh, shit! I fucking... Knew it, I should have fucking shot. I fucking even said if he got shot. A sharp pain cold went through my stomach. I dropped on my knees, bloody pull around my feet. Mikey, 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 Mikey. You had me worried for a second there. The smell of pin knife glittered in Sarah's hand. 
but I wasn't re really that worried. I can see it's sad. Your your sad, adorable eyes. I can feel it in my bones. You wanted me to be the real Sarah. It's so sweet how you love me so much. Even at to this point, dueled in yourself. I love you too, sweetheart. She knelt beside me. I flinched at her cold hands brushed their hair off my face. But I'm sorry to say, I think we have to break up. I found a new host. No. No! Does this mean? It's only natural. I mean, why do I have to settle for a trouble? your troublesome ass? When the fetish little Sarah is finally locked, I rim tied like a gift. Thanks, by the way. She put up of such a fight. I struggled to get up. She pulled up my hair and pinned me down to the ground. Uh uh, uh, uh not going anywhere, sweetie. She smacked her lips in delight. Oh! Oh! Oh shit! I knew I should have shot that bitch. But it was fucking rushing me, man. I didn't know. I was trying to quick save that. Uh. My body felt paralyzed. Already my hands and feet became numb. S Sarah, I think I'll have fun with you first. I wanted to fight, to cry out, but the frayed edges of my vision faded steadily into the back. The sound of Sarah's screams was endless, uh, endless lullaby. Fuck, I got another bat in him, the victim. Fuck berries. Nah. Nah, we're not gonna end it. We're not gonna end it. We're gonna go back. Or right, we're back. We're shooting this bitch. Fuck you! For the last time, you asshole. I didn't have time to think, think it through better. I didn't have a choice. I did have a choice. I knew I shouldn't have shot the bitch. Fucking Evans told me I shot him in that fucking arm. Idiot. Did I? I watched Sarah's body crumble to the floor in a heap. My heart ached as she lo looked at me with sadness and confusion. What happened? I... No. No. Dots. A low, amused laughter resonated behind the door. Sarah? Well, I killed someone. I killed the bitch. I ran to her grasping body and cr cradled her head in my arms. Please, no! I have to stop the bleeding. I have to. But the circle red grew uh, of red and grew larger and larger and around Sarah's body. Sarah! Sarah! It's not Sarah, dumbass. Behind, behind me, the door creaked open, cracked open. The cursed here. What? 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 What the fuck was that? Oh my god. What the f Another bad end. Fuck. Fuck. Okay. This time we're not gonna shoot at all. Let's see how this is gonna go. I decided to take a step back and relax. The breath that came out of my lips wavered and shook. Nevertheless, my sp speeding heart thanked me for my comfort. But. I still need to decide soon. Mike, time is running out. But what the fuck? If I shot her, that was actually her. But if I didn't shoot her, that was a fucking fake. The fuck? Time is running out. Please hand me the gun. Well, what should I do? Oh my god. Something bad is going to happen if I don't decide now. Dots. But I'm so confused. I'm fucking confused too. Like, what the fuck, man? I need more time. Think, Mike. Think. Think, 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 think. 
brain blast. <laughs> if you guys know what that means in reference. <clears throat> there has to be another way out. out. I'm way out of this. Okay, a quick shade. You know what? I'm not even going to pick another choice. I'm not going to pick a choice. Ask a question. Yes, give me that choice. All right, quick save, just in case. Wait! I should ask you both a question so I can make sure which one is the real Sarah. Damn it. Damn it, Mike. Haven't we established the trivia question being jack shit? <laughs> I mean, it kind of worked. I mean, you fucking figure out who was Mike. Well, I'm out of ideas. Dots. Fine. Make it count then. Immediately, I was trying to buy time before the inevitable. In 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 inevitable happens. I probably said that wrong, but I know. Fucking, I used to say that shit a lot. Whatever. I struggled to come up with the one perfect question that will lead me to the right Sarah. Finally, oh, I like how the music's speeding up. Finally, a spark flew into my mind. I turned to the Sarah in front of me. The Sarah inside the room is wounded. She told me her injuries. Okay. Which shoulder? Not the shoulder. It was the bullet wound in the right thigh. I managed to land a bullet on it downstairs. I noticed Sarah roll my jaws clench. The Sarah inside room didn't really tell me any injuries. That is true. But if this is the real Sarah, then she would then she would be correct. Alright, quick save. Think. Wait, should I think? Alright. I need one uh, to ask one last question. I turn to the Sarah behind the door. This Sarah standing in front of me is injured. What are the, her injuries? Dialogue dislodge, dislodge right shoulder and fractured fingers. Must have broken it when he was strangling me. There you go. <sighs> Wait, that's it? Everything was made clear the la by the last question. I was glad I took the time to think. I faced my the wound, the wounded Sarah in front of me. There was no doubt about it. All right, time to shoot this fucker. Please, I mean, please. Fuck you, you asshole. That's what you get. The sound of the gunshot made my ears ring in a note. I will remember forever. Sarah, Sarah, crumpled to the floor. I brought the gun down to my side and walked to, over to her. I looked in her eye. They were indeed hers. This is embarrassing. Being killed by a human. Dots. You know what, though? Sarah, she's not afraid of dying, so, so. Sarah held up her hand to me. Hold me. M Mike, P please. No, fuck that. No, I'm not gonna fucking hold you. I'm gonna shoot you again, motherfucker. Shut the fuck up. You're such a liar. I was just... Ugh. I took her cold hands into my... Why the fuck would you do that? And warmed it with my breath. Monster or not, this was my Sarah. Mike, you are one stupid fuck. That isn't it. Didn't matter at all. Not right now, while she was... She is helpless and dying rapidly in front of me. Reluctant tears fell from her. I'm sorry guys, I thought I fucking heard breathing. Like, no, there. <clears throat> Reluctant tears fell from my, from my face. I know what Sarah wants for her birthday. Oh, okay. Tell us, bro. So before you die, uh, just tell me so I can get some mm, some good action. Stop talking. You'll just strain yourself. She'll never tell you, but I know what it is. 
dots. Is it about like getting married or something or, like a ring? If it is, something borrowed. Oh, okay. Something blue. <coughs> Dark blood spluttered out of Sarah's mouth. Oh shit, she shivered. Mike, be careful. Wait, what? Why are you telling me to be careful? You're the one that tried to kill us, both you ass. You know about us now. That they won't like. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, at least he's being cool, or she, or it, whatever the fuck it is. It is being cool. You know about us now. They won't like it. What was the real reason? Why did they start it in the first place? What? Who is they? They might. <coughs> I'm cold. Cold. Mike? What's happening? Are you there? P please. The real Sarah's voice called from the inside. I turned to the door and looked back at the, at the fake Sarah. Go. Dots. Oh! We're getting the real good ending. Dots. Sarah, I'm okay. M Mike? I'm here. I walked to the door. Everything's okay now. I'll get you out of there. Mike, I... I thought... She stu started to sob. Oh, I, I waited patiently behind the door. Just open the door. What is wrong with you? Come on. Pretty soon I heard her sniff and take a couple of calming breaths. Okay. I'll push the door and you pu you'll pull it open, right? All right. On three. Oh, that scared the shit out of me. There you go. The door finally gave, gave, a, uh, gave way and Sarah jumped into my arms as soon as I opened. My ribs com complained and I croaked in pain. Almost the same time Sarah winched because of her injuries. We both laughed. How did you know it was me? I was really worried back there. I... I just got lucky. Well, I did try like uh, twice. Uh, what do you mean? I thought you had some sort of plan. Yes and no. It was a long shot. It didn't come to me at once after all. So what was the point of asking about our injuries? To stall for time originally, but actually managed to prove my theory after all. A theory, hmm? Dots. It was your voice. My voice? I hope the creature wouldn't mind, uh, re wouldn't remember that little detail. When you first called me, you sounded really strange. Your voice, it was raspy and sounded like it belonged to a different person. And then while I was asking you the question, you suddenly mentioned the str strangling incident. That's when it all clicked. You were str uh, strangled just recently. That's why you didn't sound like yourself. Oh, that's right. That is a good point, Mike. It was a significant damage to your voice box. The other Sarah's voice sounded just fine. Dots. You're right. What? You did get lucky. It was a stressful situation, all right. It was the most br <laughs> It was the <laughs> it was the most my brain could come up with. Dots. Sarah grinned. She pushed my old, grimy glasses up to my nose. Aww. I guess we have to be thankful for the little details. Is it over, Mike? Dots. I hope so. I mean, remember what the fucking fake said. But as we turned to look to the fallen imposter, it had disappeared from sight. Red drip, red drop, uh, red drops of blood made a trail for the open for the open window. Oh shit, did he get out of the window? It escaped! Damn! I didn't say anything. I know she, she'd she be worried and alarmed that the creature was loose, but I didn't care at the moment. 
Hey, fucking if we escape, if we came back again, I would have made sure I got killed, like shoot it, then open the door for my girl. <clears throat> Aww, this is a sweet moment. This is a sweet moment here. Yes, it is. Seeing Sarah lifeless with blood curdling on the floor just a while ago. And now this Sarah is alive in my arms. I can't shake the feeling that I've been given a second chance. I held Sarah in my arms and hugged her tight. Do you even think it, it will come? Oh, it will ever come back? What? Dots. Yeah, you didn't think about that, you dumbass. Well, if it does, we'll be ready. Oh. N1, the catalyst. Story and art by really Roy. Uh, sorry, if I can't say that. I really enjoyed this game. This was good. This was good story work, freaking, and like investigating. Like, it was really good. I, I really enjoyed this game. Proofs Coca-Cola Cat. UI design, okay. It was really a fun game. I really recommend you guys to play this. Music, Kevin McLeod. Ah, oh, everyone loves Kevin McLeod. I even love his songs and from freesound.org. Well, yeah, it was really a good game. I enjoyed the artwork, the, how the story is. Special thanks to Morgan and Lex and Lemisofts for more. But yeah, it's been really fun. I really, like I said, Mike, who is Mike? A Renpy game. All rights reserved, 2015. Really was. I really enjoyed the story of it. It was rushed. It was most, this, this game was mostly thinking, think quickly and be a little bit of a detective and just being yourself, guys. Don't lose that. Thanks for playing. So in the meantime, guys, um, let's let's go with extras. Oh, what? Oh, it's just those. Oh, okay. Nope. Never mind. Anyways, guys, I hope you guys have um enjoyed this little series because I enjoyed it it fucking shocked me scared me a little bit and also some other interesting stuff so I hope you guys have a good night good evening and good morning from wherever you're from so peace out and sayonara guys until the next video and other games I'll be happy to play for you guys bye bye for now <laughs>